on how to create and upload your own custom fonts with Bricks. So in your WordPress dashboard all you need to do is to go to Bricks and then custom fonts and this is a custom post type so the interface should look familiar to you. And the first thing we need to do in order to create a new custom font is just to click this add new button and this brings us to our new custom font screen. First of all we're gonna give our font a title or a name. This is what's going to show up in the builder later. And the second and also last thing we need to do is just to upload all our font variants. So in case you've got a normal font, you would just select normal here and then the font style can be normal, italic or oblique. I'm just gonna keep this normal and then we click on edit. And now you can choose your font file. So depending on which format you have your fonts, you need to select one of those three. And the recommended one is just this WAF font file format. This is a compressed um, font format and it also has full Internet Explorer 9 support. This is what we're going to use in this example. So I just click on upload and then I'm just going to select my WOOF file from my computer. I'm just going to scroll down, select this um, Gilroy regular, click open. Okay, I'm going to select it. And I'm also going to add a bold font variant, same process, go here, I select bold, okay, select, and all I need to do is to click publish. And now you can also see our font preview here. So this is how the font looks like in font weight normal. And this is the bold font here. If we go back to custom fonts. You can see it's also in our list here. So I have seven custom fonts now. Let's just go to the Builder and reload it in order to see our new font. And now whenever I'm editing my typography control, this new font should show up. So in my example here, I'm going to use this heading. Then I go to Font Family and you can see here we have our standard fonts. And if I scroll down, you can see our custom fonts here. If you scroll further down, we have all of our Google fonts. So I'm just going to click on Gilroy and you can see now it's selected, it's rendering my Gilroy font in the normal font weight. If I want to use bold, I'm going to select 700. And that's pretty much it. It's all you need to do in order to upload and create your own custom fonts. You can edit and then create as many fonts as you want. You can also see here which font files have been uploaded for any particular custom font and that's it.